I created an app called Pyvapo. Uh, the problem that I saw for me to create Pyvapo is that most of the children are ill minded and they don't have time with their parents to tell them issues that are vital to their health and well being. So I saw that long ago people were used to be taught moral values using folk tales. So we can bridge that gap between the parents and the children using moral values and also via technology that we have now today. This app consists of Gogo, Tete, Novels, Proverbs, Nyamo. Gogo, here we have the folk tale that gives you the moral value at the end. And we have the Tete. You can type in your problem and Tete can solve that problem. We have the novels where you can read the novels and your English language can improve. We also have the proverbs that you can use in your English essays. And we have Nyambo for interesting people. And it is also that children can learn easily when they are being told funny stories. What motivated me to create this app? As for me, I don't have time with my parents to tell them what is really happening at school or anything that I'm facing. So with this technology that is now available in this generation, I saw that it is a solution to create an app that can actually help other children out there who are in the same situation that I am. Uh, actually, I want to tell this app to the market, but not by making people subscribe using this app. I will be selling app merchandiser and also the authors will be advertising their novels on the platform. As for me, I heard the stereotype that programming and technology is only for boys. But when I was introduced to programming, I actually saw that girls can do better. What men can do, girls can do better. And with that conclusion, I want to become a computer scientist or a computer engineer. For these and other stories, visit our website www.263chat.com. Follow us on Twitter at 263chat and like our Facebook page 263chat.